I'm Julie Eau Claire. You're watching Parents TV. Bath time is a great time to bond with your baby, and it also helps your little one relax before bedtime. Here with some great new bath products that will not only entertain your baby but keep her safe too is American Baby Senior Lifestyle Editor Jessica Hartshorn. Thank you for coming in. Thank you, Julie. It's always good to see you and yeah. you've got great products today. Mm -hmm. We're going to start with the tubs. And the wash pod, that's something I've never seen before but it's a great idea. Yeah, Prince Lionheart came out with this wash uh, pod. It's kind of, it's like a, it's a bucket but made specifically for a baby. It's got a special insert in there to sit a young one in. It's for zero, so birth to up to six months. And it's it makes a little them baby. feel more secure? Because some some babies don't like being laid back in water or having their arms flailing, so this sort of bundles them and keeps them sitting upright. And uh, it's easy for a mom to use sometimes too, but if you want to go with a more traditional infant tub, there's also something like the uh, Fisher Price Rainforest Bath Center. This has a newborn sling, so you do lay a baby back in there, and then uh, as the baby grows a little older and you can sit up with your support. You can sit them in the regular green tub. And when is that? When can they start sitting up? About four months, five months, six months. And then after six months, they should start being able to sit up on their own. And at that point, you can move them out of the infant tub and into the big tub. But again, always with your supervision. You never, ever walk out of the room when your baby's in water. Take the baby with you if you have to go. Right. If the doorbell's ringing and you can't ignore it, then you take your baby with you. Otherwise, try to pick bath time uh, to be a time when you don't have to answer the phone or have any distractions. Exactly. And you have some great toys in here to keep your baby entertained mm -hmm. when you're in the tub little doggies and the and this is a great Munchkin, yeah. Munchkin makes their white hot duck to tell you if the bath temperature is too hot. That'll say hot and white if uh, the temperature is too far over 100 degrees. There's also um, some great little stuff from Little Tykes and from Alex. That guy comes with the Fisher Price tub. You get a couple toys with it. I love bath toys. They're so fun. And now, um, also this Pelican is yeah. fantastic because it's a it's a big uh, jug to keep the water and to sort of wash your baby's hair with. Mm -hmm. To rinse off a young baby, or when your toddler toddler's a little older and you need to wash their whole head, this kind of gets it all in one scoop. That's uh, also by Munchkin. And the little doggies are from Alex. If you put them in hot water, you can wash their spots off. Which is so much fun, yeah. isn't it? You wash the dirty dog, make it clean. Okay, now that we have our babies in the tub, we need good products for sensitive skin because babies can be very sensitive. What have right. you brought? Well, yeah, you want to pick something baby specific from the baby aisle. I am a big fan of all the lavender wash stuff because I do think that bath time is the best pre bedtime ritual. It signals to your baby or your toddler that the day is done, we're moving on toward bedtime. Helps and if you, them relax. Yeah, and if you make it a routine every night, it really does cue them that they're going to start getting tired and it's time to do you know some bedtime but if you if you need to use it as like a problem solving time for your baby's skin you want to choose a moisturizing bath um, and if your baby's prone to rashes, whether it's eczema or heat rash or diaper rash, mm -hmm. I love the Aveeno oatmeal bath. That must be really soothing. Yeah, it, it, it kind of stops an itch right away. Uh, it, so they even recommend it for things like, um, you know, mosquito bites or anything like that. Um, and then if your baby does have a rash, whether it's on their bottom or even on their chin from drool, mm -hmm. you can use something like uh, Dust and Clear, which is petroleum based. And what I really love is the Sassy Visor because you want to keep the suds and the water out of their eyes. Right. And I know my son doesn't like that at all. So. Even if it doesn't sting, they just don't like that sensation of all the water coming over their face so this visor keeps it all off of them. Okay now we have them out of the tub we need to dry them off or when they're in to clean them and this is some great towels you have. Yeah these are just some washcloths I picked up at Target because you want to bulk up on a lot of washcloths some of them are gonna get kind of grimy. I mean babies don't get that dirty they're not out in the mud but you right. know they get enough milk and okay, they sure else. do believe me. They're messier than you'd think. They're very, they could be very <laughs> messy. This is adorable this this um, that little towel. towel. Those are made by uh, Pottery Barn Kids and Land's End also makes little hoodie towels. Faces on and it has a tail and paws on the side. It's absolutely adorable. Now, you want to keep them entertained. Yeah. These little uh, toys in the tub are great, but you also want to have some bigger toys. Yeah, these are for an older kid, maybe like three okay. or four. This one is fantastic. This is for, for girls, well, boys too, for that matter, but you can dress up the little dolls and it sticks to the side of the uh, the tub. Yes, and this is a rub-a-dub shaving in the tub for a little kid who wants to pretend to be a mommy or daddy shaving in the tub. It's got like, you know, foam and then a fake razor. Now, you know, they love to play pretend. For you, the musician oh, in your yeah, family. This. this is a xylophone that floats in the tub. Tub tunes, again from Alex. So right on the top of the water and then they can play. And they make other yeah. instruments too, right? Right, they make little horns and this is a shaker. Okay, and then uh, you have these in the front here. We've talked about the little doggies and this. You just pull the string Sassy on Sassy makes one. that little boat, yeah. He and all different kind of animals, water. right? Yeah. Okay. And then those uh, letters stick to the side of your tub with water. I like those because you can use them to teach your kid how to spell their name. And this is by? That's also from Alex. This is from Alex. Mm -hmm. you could, they can spell all kinds of things.
things. My daughter's five. She still loves to spell with those. Right. Okay, moving on over here, the whale sorter. Yeah, that's a little shape sorter for maybe a younger kid or, you know, one or two-year-old. I think that's also from Alex. And then um, uh, bath writers are a fun idea. Crayola also makes crayon uh, tubs, although these ones are from Alex where you can... Um, Kids can draw all over the tub, but then it's very easy to wipe Just right off. Just wash it all off, yeah. so no mess for mom. And one thing that we, we didn't mention over here, this is the organizer, the sorter, so you can keep all your products together, and it also drains the water out. Right, it's a corner organizer, also from Fisher Price, which matches their rainforest line. To bottom line, we're keeping our kids safe with all these products, but having a lot of fun in the tub, too. Yeah, because it's, a, it's it really is one of the few times when you're sitting and giving your child all your attention, because you have to for safety, being right there next to them. But it's a great time to play and have fun together and just a little, you know, wind down routine together. And I, a really I good time like to it. bond. Yes. Okay. Yeah. All right, Jessica Hartshorn, mm -hmm. thank you so much for coming in. We appreciate you telling us all about these great new products and bath safety at the same time. Thank you. And thank you for watching Parents TV, your source for the best information for your growing family. Thank you for watching Parents TV, our families, our lives.